Beautiful morning on the Pew Lake, having my coffee. Um, it has this little beach. The water levels are still high this year again, so the beach is not huge, but it's beautiful for walking out. I went for a swim last night and um, no weeds or anything like that. So that's really nice. And just the calm, gorgeous water this morning up to the campsite so that campsite it's okay but uh, we forgot how slanted it is so it's really hard when you're tenting to um, not be sliding all night but actually I slept really well last night the temperature was perfect um, this would be a really good site if you were hammocking but I think next time we're on Nepew, I think we're going to check out a different campsite because it's just time to see something new. But this one did the trick. The scenery is really awesome. Um, really peaceful. Fish jumping all night. So one more night for this adventure, which will be at Sluice Falls. I can't believe it and we're at Sluice Falls um, I hate that portage I, I know it's long and I thought oh you know we know it's long we know what to expect it was grueling there's a lot of mud this year uh, but we made it through and we got camp set up it was 33 degrees while we were portaging so pretty hot and uh, kind of just chilled out with a couple drinks and then some wind and rain picked up so had to set up this tarp and uh, now it's sunny and really comfortable so we're gonna shower tonight which will be really nice you just have a little portable shower where you, you pump the, the air up to give pressure and a little nozzle it works pretty slick for this situation uh, I'm going to bring you down to Sluice Falls though, so you get to see the view that I have. Okay. So here is our tent. And this is what, when we get up in the morning, this is what we're going to look at. I'll bring you down to an even better view of the falls. The only thing is it's a pain in the butt to get water because we have to scoop it actually from the waterfall. Uh, down at the beach, it's pretty grimy. Um, there's like, it's just all churned up down there. So this water comes up clean, that's one thing. And you'll see why this is a portage.
I'll be booting down the lake that way. It's kind of more of a stressful day because there's some rapids that are a bit uncomfortable to ride, uh, but there's some fun ones too. So I will have videos tomorrow for you there. We are just um, heating up some water now for the shower and uh, gonna have some shepherd's pie tonight again. So it's gonna be a good night. There's also a couple bottles of wine that we saved. So it's been a great trip. Uh, and this is a great last night. Okay, so here is a little tour of our backwoods shower. Dwight has it all rigged up there. So we got our privacy tarp. And here's the little little shower. So this is really lightweight to carry around. It um, packs down quite small. And then you just step on that foot pedal down there to uh, make sure the air pressure inside will will power up your little shower nozzle. So pretty slick for the backwoods. You really can have every comfort that you have at home. <laughs>